Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Annie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector, and it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we'll be reviewing a throwback review to an old school Transformers toys from a line called Transformers Construct Box. And these figures came out in 2013. So these figures are pretty old now. First we'll be reviewing is Ironhide. He's a nice looking bot. I'm not going to bother transforming these because they're really brittle and easy to break. So it's just going to be a robot mode review. Because I've had these figures for so ever and they're so brittle. Articulation with Ironhide, you get bend at the knee, ankle tilt, head is on a tight ball joint, arm goes out that far, bend at the elbow, backwards bend if you want to do that, same like the first, get a lot of articulation, bend at the knee, Bend at the knee, which is really nice. And that's all the articulation for Ironhide. But a lot of articulation. You get bend at the elbow. Bend at the hand if you want it. That's all there is to say for Ironhide. And he's a simple figure to bend and transform. I'm not going to bother transforming him because he's so tight and brittle. Optimus Prime. He's got a lot of bend in. Arm is on a ball joint, which is nice. I love it about these construct bots. Head is on a tight ball joint. A lot of ball joints on these figures. And I just dig them for all that ball joint goodness. Nice bat pack. And that's all there is to say for this review. I knew these figures would go pretty quickly on the review. Because they were very simple bots. Probably wondering, where did I get these? Well, I was given Optimus Prime and Ironhide. And I've had them for a while now. By a friend of mine, I think from a special needs program. Other than that, these are worthwhile bots to add to your collection if you're a Transformers enthusiast like me. And I am so glad to have Optimus and Ironhide part of my collection from the Construct Bots line. I would highly recommend picking these up if you can find them complete for a good price. That's all there is to say for this review. And this is Eddie Hill, moving on and rock on and rock out YouTube land.